Hey, babe, you hear that buzzing? Shit, it's a whole swarm of bees. Maybe I can use the hose to get rid of them. Want to help me? No. Go somewhere else. <laughs> That sounds fun. On the tables, we want to have flowers, but we want it to be all like completely backwards. And that's, that's what Alice in Wonderland is all about, right? Everything is like, backwards. It's like, like well, Mad Hatter is about being completely backwards. It really wouldn't be your birthday, it would be your unbirthday. See, I don't know if I've ever really seen the movie. Mad, Mad Hatter, Hatter doesn't have anything to do with Alice in Wonderland? Yeah. Oh, Mad okay. Hatter's in Alice in Wonderland. Okay. Part of it. Yeah. Okay. Right. What do you think? About that hat idea. Do you want to do everyone? You, you can't get in unless you have a hat on because it's like Mad Hatter and you have to wear a hat to get in. It's, I, don't I mean, it could that. be like a suggested theme. Right. Oh, what so, is that? It's the soft shell crab. You, you know what I just remembered? What? That's what I had at the Ivy and I hated it. All right, someone's gonna have to tell yeah, me how to eat that. Yeah, I don't even know how. Do you, Leah? We'll just look at it. It's like a crab. I can't just eat. eat the leg. I think you just pull this off. Right? All right, we need to. I think we should ask somebody. Should we ask him? How, how do we eat that? <laughs> no, how do we eat the crab? We don't know. We don't know how to eat. You that. eat the whole thing. Oh, you eat, eat the, the whole thing. Yeah, the whole thing. Oh. Legs, uh, shell is way soft. Okay. Soft shell crab. You eat the whole thing. Okay. Does it digest like it, well? Yes. yes. By yourself. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't, I don't think I'm... Maybe we should tell them that we don't like it? No. Yeah. I think we should be like, this is not what we thought it was. That way we don't have to pay for it. Put that leg back on there. Cheers. <laughs> to planning a party. To planning the birthday. May I help you? <laughs> Can I get a Hummer? What? Can I get a Hummer? What do you have on? A Hummer. Can I get a Hummer? Car? Yeah, car. I can get it. Is that what you're talking about? H2. The H2? And the right with you? So you want to go to Home Depot today? Home I'm kissing your neck and you ask at Home Depot? <laughs> what the hell is wrong with that picture? I have to go get that bee stuff. Otherwise, my little ivy's gonna die. I can't water it because I can't get another damn sprinkler. So, why don't you call a bee exterminator? Because I am the bee exterminator. Well, I'm gonna be in the house while you play with the bees. But I'm definitely afraid of them. You gotta hold the hose. No way. What if they kill bees and they attack? You just sit in the house and watch them die out there in the dusty field? Baby, killer bees are extinct. They're in, they're in California and they're in Nevada. My breast thing. The bee killer. I'm just gonna send you over there. You can breathe on the hive. Be exterminated. <laughs> All right, bee killer. Draperies. No, I'm not getting my draperies at Home Depot. Excuse me. I'm looking for something to kill like bees. Are you sure you have honeybees? <laughs> All their bees for sure. They're fuzzy. Yeah. You know where the hive is? Yeah. There is no product market for bees. Yeah, but they sting you. There's nothing to kill bees. Let's kill wasps, yellow jackets, bees. Hey, that looks good to me. I have a question. Hmm. Why didn't we just go to the grocery store? I have an answer. Shut it. Let's buy that bee spray. Come on. I'm out of here. Well, I'm not quite done yet. I need a couple more things. What are you going to get? Don't worry about it. I want to worry about it. Maybe I could just start cultivating their honey and make my own honey at home. No, let's not make honey, honey. You're kidding, right? Ooh, instant carpet yeah, spot awesome. remover. You're so weird. I can't believe you get off on this kind of stuff. It might be good for cleaning around my house. Shouldn't I be thinking about that? Yeah, you should, but since you weren't, I'll have to. Oh, honey. What do you give me this stuff for? It's funny. Think hard. Anything else we need? We don't need wood. No, but I need a plug. Why don't you build a skylight while you're at it? 
Uh, it's hot here. They don't have air conditioning at Home Depot. Don't they sell air conditioners? Oh, baby. What? It's hot. Hey, I have a question for you. Sure. I have a plug at home just had a, a face plate on. I took the plate off. It has three black wires and three white wires. Uh, it has the wire nuts on it like it's capped off for a reason. When they run wires, they run it from the panel. Then they'll run it to another plug and then to another plug. Oh, see, I see. You could put an outlet in there. Oh, I could? It's blank right now. Yeah, it's blank. There's nothing in it. Yeah, you could add an outlet to it. Is it something pretty easy to handle, or should I get an <clears throat> electrician to come in here and do it? You could do it yourself. Yeah? Yeah. And these other ones I just screw in and leave alone? Yeah. All you need to do is bring it to one of these. Perfect. That'll work. Hey, babe, you gonna make it? Yeah. All right, let's go. It's time to One more leave. thing, and then we're out of here. What? Can I get Justin? Love, send it to the front seat. Corey, you have a call in 859. Corey, 59, please. I appreciate it. All right, almost done. You want to get in? I'll push you. No, I don't want to get in. Well, you, you look so tired. I don't know if you can make it. I'm not going to get in that. All right, you're on his guy here. Good. Successful trip to Home Depot. That was great. Well, baby, what all did you want to get? Are you mad at me? I'm fine. I'll hang out. Oh, that's fine. Oh, boy. The stuff is so random that they have. I mean, how do people think of this stuff? Goo? Goo gone? Like, how does somebody think of that? Thank you. Well, that was fun. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I love Home Depot. It rocks. <laughs> I hope this stuff works. Nick? Yeah, babe? Where are you going? I'm going to see if I can kill the bees. Oh, well, you do that, I'm going to work out, I think. Huh? I think I'm going to work out. OK. I'll be right back. trying to do is get the sprinklers on so our freaking ivy didn't die. All for the ivy. Oh, you see it. There's like hundreds of bees laying on the ground. <laughs> You're crazy. Hey, babe. Looks like you had a hard workout. Did you use all the bee killer? I went through a whole can. Just trying to get in there because I couldn't see. And when I got over the top of it, you could see that they were just underneath there. And all you gave was just... <laughs> bees didn't f me, though. They know better. I need to call Nadia to clean the house, right? No. My friends are flying in tomorrow for my birthday, and the house is a mess. Hey, Mom! You all just getting here? Yeah. Hang on a second. Mwah. Happy birthday! Thanks. House is like Christmas! I have friends from Dallas, uh, Casey, who is my road manager. Stephanie and I have been best friends since eighth grade, and Cooper, she's going to be here in like five minutes. Your present's here. How cute. I had to check my bag because of this, because I was like, they're going to think I'm going to oh. eat, eat. Right. someone on the plane. Okay. Eat, eat. How to clean. Yeah. Wash yeah. by hand. Yeah, we have ours too, but it's How are you? You're almost 23 years old. Oh, 23 is old. Yeah. It's almost 25, which is almost mid-20s. Jess, I went there last night to the place where your birthday party's at. It was really cool. We are at the Concord, preparing for Jessica Simpson's Mad Hatter unbirthday party. Right now we have Schwag Bags, which is a gift bag company that we're using, along with all the teacups that we're using. We're gonna say drink me, tie in the whole thing, hanging, playing cards. Whoever's idea that was, it's a really good idea. Was it your idea? Yeah, it was my idea. Whatever, it was my idea. 
We're married, so I can take credit. So everything is, is slowly coming together right now. Okay, so look, Jess, here's what you got, baby. I think you're going to love oh, wow. it. <laughs> we have Elmo, and we have the Cookie oh, Monster. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome, Apple. honey. Oh, Nick, this is yours, baby. This is for those hard days. Oh, and Jessica's driving you crazy. Fill it up now. That's hilarious. Oh, somebody's in the front door. Cupid let his arrows fly. Since you go. Look at all the flowers. To be my, be my heart. They're so pretty. Love is what you bring to me. These flowers are beautiful. Oh my god, there's more. Those red ones are from Nick and Hair. I love my house right now. I love flowers. I love you. Thank you for me. Flowers, I love birthdays. Okay, baby, I want down. Hey, Nick, I'm going to go change and take the girls shopping. Okay, babe. Jessica and I, we did a fashion show for GM around Oscar award time. And one of the perks of doing the show was that anyone who was involved in the show got to drive a General Motors car for three months. And we chose the Hummer, which is pretty cool. Doing? We're shopping, spending all your money. What are you doing? Uh, Justin and I are driving around in the Hummer. Is it real big? It's definitely big. I mean, I, I don't see you driving it, but see what you think. Okay, love you, babe. I love you too. Bye. You know, when a guy tells you he was made to climb mountains, I mean, what are you supposed to do? Yeah. Hi, man. Have you? A number two with a Coke. We're home. We have a Hummer. She's not even driving her own car? Yeah. She's tired. Oh. Hey. Cool car. I don't think you're going to be able to pull it in the garage. Well, that's okay. I'll leave it for you to pull in. Can we drive it? No, not yet. Scared of it? Yeah, a little bit. But Nick, look at my cute little anklet. <laughs> He's got a car. She's showing him the anklet. Isn't that adorable? It doesn't really compare to the Hummer, though. Oh, what do we do now? Oh, Cooper, I wanted to read this. Judgment Day? Yeah. Do you want to act it out? Cooper and I wrote a script when we were juniors. The synopsis, Julie and Lauren are sisters who are driving to church and having an argument. They get into a wreck and find themselves in an unfamiliar place. I'm embarrassed for you. No, listen. I'm listening to it. I just don't see why I have to go. I go every Sunday morning and that's only because my mother drags me there. What's happened to you? <laughs> You're not the same. I am the same. I've just matured and grown into a young adult. Julie, are you really happy? I'm not discussing this with you. What I would like is for you to drop me off at Kimberly's house and leave me alone. No, I won't drop you off because I know you'll end up at the party in the back. <laughs> what are you talking about? You're pissing me off. Take a ride up here. No, you're going to church. <laughs> Take a ride here. Julie, stop it. Let go. Watch out. There's a car. The car wrecks and the lights go out. That's the wreck. <laughs> is this real? Did we die? Are you not watching our podcast? Yes, yes, I'm not listening. Mm -hmm. Whew, this is good stuff. I can't read this anymore. <laughs> that was our play. Did y'all read this a lot in class? We had two chairs. We actually like a car. Oh, and, and oh. the embarrassing thing is, oh. I wore a mini dress to school that day, and what? I had a thong on underneath oh, yeah. it. And we were like driving. We have to have like fake a car oh. crash, and, and you, stupid blonde me, <laughs> and like Bella falls off fell and over, and all the guys were like, "Woo!" <laughs> yeah, Leah, it's Nick. I got a question about the party. So at some point, are we going to bring out the cake and sing happy birthday? Yeah, yeah, that'd be great. It's going to be a great night. Well, everything cool? It's going really good. It's just we're frantically trying to get everything done in the next 20 minutes. But I think everything will be okay. Everything will be all right, right? Yeah. How much longer, babe? My hairdresser, Kim Pavis, and my makeup artist, Karen Mitchell, always create a different kind of look for me. And since it was my birthday party, I definitely wanted to go for the sex kit and vixen type of look with the long lashes and the Barbarella type of do. Hey, hey, hey. You guys about ready? Yeah, Leah, I know the party started an hour ago, but they're still working on her. We're going. Oops, I forgot something. Hold on a minute. Jessica's been in the bedroom for three hours. If we don't leave soon, we're gonna miss the party. Hey, babe, you look great. Y'all look great. Oh, yeah. Everybody looks great. I love birthdays. I'm excited, guys. Yes. Oh, oh, it's your party. It's your birthday. Oh. 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 I do that with 
everybody all the time I'm psychic, I think. I read people's minds. Did somebody burp? I did, but it was very quiet. <laughs> yeah. Did you eat Chinese food? <laughs> Your and present is good idea. Tuesday. I would Tuesday. You know, right. Sorry, I couldn't hear earlier. Just whatever you need tonight, you let me know. Oh, it's hard to see you. You smell like an incense. You mean incense? Mick, don't make fun of me. <laughs> you ready? I'm ready. Okay, let's toast, do it. Toast. Here's to Jessica. She gets older and more mature and wiser and more beautiful every year. Aww. Oh my goodness. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Order, I feel slightly less like a pervert. You know, it's, it's slightly less robbing the cradle. So oh. every birthday is a good thing for me. Happy birthday, dear Jessica. Happy birthday to Jessica, you have only one shoe on. I know, I don't want to put the other one on because well, it hurts. Take the other one off instead. No, because I got to look cute. <laughs> Let's go. Give me cut one. So did you like your party? It was the best ever. Can I get that now? Nick, I'm feeling okay today. You know, I have all my friends here. I think my parents are gonna come over and I'm gonna open up presents with them and with my friends. My parents gave me the Louis Vuitton wallet to match my bag. Oh, wallet! <laughs> and then my sister gave me the Louis Vuitton coin bag. Oh, I'm happy. So I have the complete Louis Vuitton set. Look what I got! <laughs> They knew that it's what I wanted. They saw how excited my purse made me, and they did it all on their own. Have you seen the beehive? Come on, put some shoes on. It's fun. You can put my Nikes on by the door. Shoes down come here. on, come on. You're in a weird mood right now. This is what happens when you go crazy. Okay. I can put your shoes on. Throw those on. These shoes are a little big. <laughs> your feet are big. I can't walk in these. Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> That's what was inside there. Like when you walked up and you heard that buzzing, it's a full on freaking hive. Is it sticky? Don't eat it! Nick! That is gross! You're never getting a kiss again. See if it tasted sweet. Stop! You're nasty, there's like mold all over that. Ah, that didn't taste good. <laughs> you mm. keep spitting. Mm. Nick, look at all that mold in there, and you licked it. I thought it'd be sweet, but it wasn't. I'm itchy, I'm going in. Do you really think you killed them all? Oh, I guarantee it. Nah. <laughs>